Well, I'm a nerd, obviously. You know, I like to I like to fix computers, really troubleshoot uh, networking and servers. Um, but then at home, uh, you know, I enjoy sports. I uh, enjoy baseball, basketball, football. I'm a diehard Blazer fan. Um, I I played baseball um, in high school and in, in college, so you know, I'm somewhat of a I guess you can call it a jock as well. So a jock nerd, which is kind of rare these days, I guess. So. My exact job here is uh, I'm a systems administrator and, and a systems engineer, I guess, because of my experience now. Um, yeah, that's the actual title. Uh, what do I fix the most? Well, last year it was definitely the iPads and connecting to the, the wireless network. Uh, we had issues the entire year. Um, this year it seems to be working just fine. So this year I've, I've had a lot of uh, projector issues. Just it's not projecting the computer or the iPad. Um, which teacher at LaSalle is the least adept to technology? Um, I'd say Mrs. Yan, <laughs> Sally Yan, so uh, yeah, she, she calls me quite often, but you know, we're working through it. Which teacher do you think is the most adept? Like, most adept? Um, shoot. Uh, John Donnelly. How do you feel about your workspace, specifically not having a window on your door? I actually enjoy not having a window on my door. Um, I can kind of hide out, uh, keep the door closed. A lot of kids know where my office is, especially the baseball players. So they try to you know, mess with me. So it's kind of nice to have that door closed and no window. But yeah, I have a window there, so that's nice. What do the baseball players do to mess with you? Uh, well, they, you know, ding dong and bitch. But <laughs> they, uh, they knock and run. So. Now, I don't get up every single time someone knocks. So I just kind of yell, come in, even though I do know it's locked, then I can hear their voice. And then I come. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what is one thing most people at LaSalle don't know about you? Oh, shoot. Um, yeah, that's a tough one. Uh, I snowboard a lot. I'm pretty decent at it now. I've, only, I've been doing it for about four years, but uh, I go up every year. Um, this question is from Caleb Marvich. Why don't you like being called IT guy? Um, I, it reminds me of like a comedy, like some show, and uh, just out of respect, I, I told him, hey, let's not call me that, and obviously you know, <laughs> kids will call me that, and yeah, it was just more out of respect than anything. Uh, what is your favorite band or current song? Favorite band would actually be a, a rapper now. His name is uh, NF. Um, he's a Christian rapper, actually. Um, pretty rare, I guess. But, uh, he's really, really good. The song Intro is a, is a great song that he does. So, uh, How has high school changed since you went through it? Um, it's a lot nicer now. Like, uh, the kids are nice. You don't have a bunch of those little groups. I mean, you do have groups here. You, you know, you have your... Um, you have your nerds, so-called nerds, right? Or you have your jocks. You have your people that don't really care about school. Um, we really had that back in my day, and uh, the groups would fight. I mean, daily we would have fights in the hallway. Uh, I have not seen one here. I've, I've heard of other high schools that you know the fights are um, as existent these days. So you know, it just seems like people are a little nicer, maybe, but that's because of social media as well. So I think there's a lot more social media bashing than there is in, you know, verbal and physical bashing, so um, I don't know what's worse. I, I probably think social media is worse. Uh, in high school, I found that I like, you know, fixing computers and taking them apart and putting them together. At the same time, I was thinking about the Air Force as well, um, just kind of following my brother's path. Uh, but I ended up going to college, uh, really to only play baseball, to tell the truth. It wasn't for the education. But since I was there, I was like, hey, might as well get somewhat of an education. So I decided to do uh, computer science, and then I found that was uh, that involved too much programming. So I went to computer information technology security. It's helpful. But uh, I played baseball for two years, and I ended up not graduating. Um, and I just started working. Um, my first job was I worked out on the sh on a shop floor in a, an iron iron shop and all I did was uh, grind metal all day and then from there I, I welded 
and after welding, I, I did a dock control. The dock, I did, that was a paper pusher. And then from there, I finally got into tech. So I've been doing technical work now for eight years. So would you say you're more self-taught or school-taught? Definitely self-taught, yeah. yeah. School, I mean, school is good for a few things, you know, uh, but really it's all about being self-taught. Yeah, so I'm, I'm married to my wife uh, for going on two years in August. Um, we got married August 2nd. We, we met and I asked her to marry me, I believe, about three months later. It was really fast. Uh, it was kind of new. Um, my daughter is actually my stepdaughter. Um, I've been in her life since she was eight months. So I call her my daughter, she calls me daddy, and um, yeah, we have a really good relationship. So she's three years old. And um, yeah, couldn't ask for a better family, really. What is your advice for high schoolers today? Uh, and you have it easy. Take advantage of it, but don't take advantage of it. You know, get your education, get good grades, listen to you know your peers, your teachers. Um, this is a good time in your life. I tell you, it's, it's the easiest time in your life. It's only gonna get harder and harder. So, might as well make it last and uh, make it worthwhile. You know, don't just don't just coast. If you coast, uh, you'll blink and you'll be my age, which I'm not old by no means. Don't get me wrong, but um, you know, I definitely envy uh, high schoolers. I mean, I would love to be in high school again. I pay money to be in high school, so yeah, it was a good time. How old are you? I'm 26. Oh. Not that old. Yeah. Yeah. If you had an arch enemy, what would they do to annoy you? Arch enemy? Oh gosh, I get annoyed very easily <laughs> by a lot of things, especially the IT guy thing, right? So um, I don't like to. I don't like to be touched a lot, like. Uh, I've had I've had friends or, or people that have just annoyed me a lot. They can always come behind me and they're touching me or pushing me, and just kind of edging me on. You know, that just makes me really mad. So <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I, I get annoyed by a lot of things.